everybody, this is Crystal Snapdragon, and I've recently started streaming a little more on Mixer, and with that, I've had to learn how to use the primary Mixer bot, which seems to be Mix It Up. Everybody seems to agree that Mix It Up is the best bot for Mixer, and it actually has a lot of functionality, so I really do recommend using this bot. You can do everything in this bot and not want for anything else. It has the capability to do everything you need to make your stream great. So I decided I would make a few tutorials for it. Because this bot is sort of similar to Discord Bot Maker and I make a lot of Discord bots, the learning curve comes pretty easily to me, but I can see it being rather difficult for others. So I have started making tutorials. This one's going to be on basic chat commands, and then we'll get into more advanced commands later. But here I'm going to show you how to make just basic chat commands, a shout out command, a hype command, a few other fun commands, and then host count, I'll show you special identifiers and get you started. Once you sort of get the hang of it, it's so easy, I promise. You're just gonna, all the creativity is gonna flow out and you're gonna have so many cool things for your stream and for your viewers to interact with. So, let's go ahead and let's get started. To get started, you're gonna go over here to the sidebar, go to commands. You'll see a lot of pre-made commands in Mix It Up, which is really nice. They already have a, your standard 8-ball, they already have your follow age, just your standard commands that most people have for Twitch, for instance. But we're going to go over here to custom commands, and you can see I've already made a ton of commands. I have a few commands that sort of act as 8-balls, so they generate random responses. I'll show you how to make those in a later video. I also have counter commands. I'll show you how to make those too. I have cues, and then I just have your standard basic chat commands. So I'm going to show you guys how to make your standard chat commands. To begin, you do new command, basic chat command. Pretty easy user interface. You choose who should be allowed to run this command. We're going to make one that should only be run by mods. You can also make and designate the cooldown for the command, and then we're going to make the trigger. So I'm going to make a smite command for my mods to use. This way, they can smite people who are being rowdy but not ban them, and it, it kind of gets relatively hilarious because I had the same command for my Twitch stream as well. So we're going to make a smite command. And down here, this is where we're going to write the argument, if you will. And so to write these arguments, you have to use what are called special identifiers. I won't go here yet. I can give you the special identifiers for this one. It's pretty easy. But we're going to say... So when you write exclamation smite at sorry, who is my roommate, for example, then sorry is a target. And so what we want it to do is to, when it responds to the command, it's going to say at target username, which would be sorry. And I'll show you the example once we're finished making this. I'll actually go and show it to you in my chat box. So we're going to say at target username has been smited by at username. And username, that's the person who wrote the command. So that's the person who triggered it. Has been smited by at username using the god's wrath. Something like that. So that is our chat command. And these command codes here, these are called special identifiers. And I'll show you how they work. So a target username, that's the target of the command. And then at username is the one who triggered it. So we'll save this here. All right. So you can actually come to your chat inside Mix It Up by going up here and going to chat. And we're just going to smite my, my mixer bot, if you will. OK. So Crestle Snap has been smited by Crestle Snapdragon using the God's Wrath. So, so that's how the special identifiers work. Now I also want to show you that your mods can add basic chat commands to your stream for you. They can't add advanced commands, but they can add basic chat commands. So I'm going to show you how your mods can add basic chat commands through Mixer itself. So first you go to add command. This is a special identifier as well. And then you're going to name it. So we're going to do hype. We're going to make a hype command. And then we're going to choose what the cooldown is. I'm going to put zero. Zero is going to be the cooldown. And now we're going to create the basic message. So 
we're going to add candy. Okay, so this is gonna be our hype command and we're adding it manually through Mixer itself. Any of your mods can do this. And now we've added a hype command. Boom, easy as pie. Now if we go back to Mixer and go back to commands, you'll find any and all commands that your mods have made under the ungrouped category. So here's my hype command here. Now that you have the basic idea of how to set up a basic chat command, I'll show you some of the ones I have. So we'll begin with, let's go to love. Love is pretty easy. Okay, this uses a particular type of special identifier to generate a random number between one and a hundred because basically what it's going to say is there is this much percent of love between the person who generated the command so the username and the at target username okay so the special identifier to generate a random number is here random number and you don't have to choose one in a hundred this, this number here is the ceiling number, basically, so it's not going to choose a number anywhere higher than 100. But you can also make it 13, you can make it 50, you could make it 1,000 if you wanted to, I believe. But this is the ceiling, this is where the number plateaus. So it's going to generate a number between 1 and 100, and then it's going to basically generate this command. So I'll show you that. I'll leave this here for a second, so if you need to read it, it's there is money sign random number 100 percent you don't need the percent the percent is not part of the special identifier but it's basically going to give a percentage so i'll show you there is 78 percent love between crystal snapdragon and crystal snap so that's how the love command works a lot of people have fun with it i enjoy it we also have here's the shout out command Okay, this one's a little bit different. Again, you should only allow mods to run the shout out command. And you might not want to give it a cooldown because Mixer can be a little bit spammy and things can get lost really quickly. Then you should probably leave the cooldown at zero so that your mods can spam it if need be. And the trigger in chat for a shout out is generally SO. And you can customize the the chat message for your stream if you want it to make it more personalized if you will but these are the general special identifiers that you need you have argument one username that's the target so if you do exclamation so at Cressel snap that's this argument one's username or you could do target username again they're an awesome streamer and then here's the special identifier that's going to generate that user's mixer url address and so you can get these if you click here and go to Special Identifiers Reference. This has everything that you need to be able to code a command and mix it up. It's really nice. So you should just take a moment at some point to look through these if you want to. This is how I get everything. So for instance, I'll show you. Let's say we want to make a host count. We want to be able to generate a command that tells us how many people are hosting our stream at that point in time. Well, here's the special identifier for it right here. So we're just going to copy that. We're going to go back into mix it up here. And now we're going to create a basic chat command. We're going to make it usable by mods and we're going to call it host count. All you have to say is this stream is being hosted by users. And now if we go here, host count, this stream right now it's zero, but if people were hosting because I'm not online, then that would be a, an actual number. So again, if we go to host count here, the special identifier for that is stream host count. Okay, this stream is being hosted by this many users. A few other ones I have. You can, you can make alert command. I have alert command here. 
This will shove the person who generates the command into a cute little box so that they can lurk in silence. Just a few fun commands here. And again, if you need to make anything really uh, more personalized to you, take a minute to look at these special identifiers. For instance, you can make a viewer count if you need to, although I wouldn't. It's best if you just don't see the number of people who are watching you. You can make a follow count, a sub count. You can do all sorts of things. So here's where you get the randoms. If you wanted to choose a random number, there's the special identifier for the random number generator, all sorts of things. So just take a minute to look at these at some point. And that's it for basic chat commands, easy as pie. If you need help, I'll put my Discord link down in the bottom info panel for the video. Please feel free to join and ask me any questions. The next video is gonna be more advanced commands dedicated to counters, like death counters, whoop whoop. So make sure you watch that as well.